Well, well, <laughs> well. We meet again. Okay, so this is probably the cringiest thing I have ever done in my YouTube uh, time on YouTube. So anyways, guys, sorry, that's probably the most cringe intro that I've ever done on a video, probably ever in my entire existence of YouTube, but we back. On this table okay because I have a few things to review for you guys I have this leather uh, leather wallet case okay for the iPhone 10s Max I just got this in the mail I'm actually really super excited to review this because um, it looks like a very high quality like leather case and it's for the iPhone 10s Max and I just thought this would be a very interesting thing to review okay guys so this is from a company called Mujo pretty sure that's how you, how you say it Mujo they're from Amazon I'll link this case down in the description below if you want to cop um, but basically guys it comes in a pretty nice you know wrapping okay so first of all the company's name is on the wrapping which that is a good sign you like to see that because that means you know they have quality products most likely so um, also guys this does retail for $49.99 so it's the same exact it's the same exact price as an Apple leather case so I want to see if this is as good or even better maybe even possibly better than the Apple leather case because I know a lot of you guys rock those case I know a lot of you guys like rock those every time you get a new iPhone that's what I do at least I get a new iPhone leather case every single time I get a new iPhone that's what that's just what I do because I like their cases so much I'm really curious to see what the quality difference is and if there is if it's better like what if it's better quality then what okay so on the back it says crafted for iPhone well I freaking hope so because it's an iPhone case so it better be crafted for an iPhone and then it says this super slim case is fully wrapped with the premium quality vegetable tanned leather never even heard that and it is designed to hold two or three of your essential cards um so the features of it is it can hold cards okay two to three cards the buttons are covered in leather that's going to be interesting because as you guys know for me buns i i like them to be really easy to press and really satisfying to press i say that in pretty much every single one of my case videos but that's just like the truth that's just like what i like about it that's just what i want to see in pretty much every single case easy to press buns and some of them aren't that easy to press so first thing that i like about this is that it has like a Ooh, that looks actually really freaking nice. What? It has this little thing where you can open it up. It shows you a little like sneak peek right there, like bang. Okay, it shows you like what, what you're about to get into, okay? So we're just gonna get this opened. How do I open it anyways? Is it like a, oh, oh. Wow. This box is really like nice. I like how they designed that box. Is that magnetic? That's magnetic. It's not Velcro, it's magnetic. We got the, the case right here. Certified authenticity, dude. So this has an authentic card. That means you know it's legit, okay? That means you know it's good quality. It smells like a lot of chemicals, I'll tell you that right now, but. Oh, it's like the new leather. It's the vegetable leather or whatever, isn't it? It's the vegetable tanned leather. So it's not even real leather. It's like vegetable, it's not real leather. Okay, so that's very interesting. Um, It does feel very, high quality though i'll tell you that right now wow that's actually super nice what the heck dude okay i'm gonna put my phone in this case right now but so far what the heck is on my finger all right well i put my finger it's kind of like weird residue that got left on my finger just wanted to show you guys that um we're gonna continue okay so i got my iphone right here i've been cases for a couple of days now as you guys know not a not a huge fan of cases. When I rock a case, it's a case that I really really like. Um, so we're gonna just try this out. We're gonna put it in there. I'm not sure I understand. What you mean? First impressions, I actually really. Yeah, it's not too big. It's like perfect, dude. So yeah, guys. Pretty much, if I had to put this in my own terms. If that's what I want to say, it's pretty much the same exact kind of thing as the Apple, like leather case. It's pretty much exact, exactly the same thing, except it's, you know, it's that vegetable leather. So it's not animal leather that you're using a 100% non animal use, like leather, which is actually a pretty cool thing because me personally, I'm a vegetarian. So, I mean, you know, I bet a bunch of you guys have not even, not even know that, but um, that's cool that they're not using any kind of animal products in this leather. I hope that's what that means. I could be wrong, but. Um, anyways, get a huge gap at the bottom right there for the speaker, the microphone, and the charging port. So all that is uh, uncovered, just like the Apple leather case, exactly the same kind of thing. The only thing that's pretty much different, I mean, it does have the cutout for the mute switch as well. Same exact kind of cutout, looks exactly 
it looks exactly the same is what I'm trying to say. But the only thing that's different about the Apple leather case in this case is that the buttons on this case are leather, which is kind of weird. And I, they actually do click very, very well. You know what I'm saying? They click very well. Uh, it's not, they're not too hard to press, which, you know, as you guys know, I said in the beginning of the video, pretty much every single video, the buttons need to be very satisfying to press. They need to be easy to press. That's the thing that's kind of different uh, that I'm actually really like, I'm really confused how like the buttons are super clickable. Like they're very clickable, like just like a metal button would be. It seems like a very high quality case. I'll tell you that right now. Like I said, this does retail for $49.99. So it's exactly the same price as an Apple Edit case. Um, but the cutouts are pretty much exactly exact, exactly exact. So this is actually surprised me a lot and how good the quality on this thing actually is. Um, on the back, it says Mujo. I'm pretty sure I'm saying that right, hopefully. Um, and it's stitched on the back of the case. They did a very nice job. I have to say they did a very, very good job. The leather seems very, very high quality. Um, it does smell kind of weird though. It does smell a little bit different. Obviously it's gonna smell different because it's not an animal leather. It's a vegetable leather, if that's actually what that actually is. But yeah, so, I mean, it seems very, very nice so far. So I'm probably gonna rock this for a couple days. Yeah, I do recommend this case. This case is very, very nice and the quality is absolute, absolutely insane, okay? Like on the inside of the case, it says Mujo, and it says 1636, I don't really know what that, what does that mean? Thir Wait, what does that even mean? But I don't, I don't even know what 1636 means, but um, yeah, guys, this is a very high quality case. I have to say that right now, like first thing that I took it out, like the box is even very high quality, like the magnets, and it's like a double flip thing, you know what I'm saying? Like it's a very high quality case. So I do recommend this case 100%. I'll leave it linked down in the description below if you guys wanna cop it, I wanna check it out. I'm pretty sure they do have different colors about it. And if you don't have an iPhone XS Max, I'm pretty sure they have it for different iPhone models like the iPhone 10 or iPhone 10 or whatever you got. Um, but yeah guys, that's pretty much it. Let me know if you guys are interested in this case. Um, and yeah, I actually really do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna use this case for a little bit because that's very cool. That has like a card holder. It's gonna be very hand, like useful. You know what I'm saying? Because all I'm gonna need is do you, all I'm gonna dry license and my card. That's all I really need to carry around. I don't need to carry around another wallet now. So yeah, guys, let me know what you guys think about this case. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you didn't, make sure you drop a like and subscribe, guys. Everybody, hold the channel. And okay, right, I'll see you in the next video. Okay, I'll see you in the, I'll see you in the next video. Test! Sup?